Hey guys, what's happening? Will and James here, E3 2016. We're here How's with Zach, going? the community manager of Kill Strain. Zach, give us the quick spiel of what this game's about. What is Kill Strain, Zach? Yeah, it's uh, kind of like a mobile build for consoles. It's uh, Currently it's a nine player, uh, three team uh, game. So it's four on one on four. Uh, the game has two teams of four humans and one team of one mutant. So as the match goes on, uh, mutants can start turning people into mutants. So you, the match ends with either all nine players being turned mutant, or one of the two bases getting destroyed, or humans can actually destroy the mutant base as well, or if there's a timeout. So it's 20 minute time limit in the match. Uh, it's really a competitive dynamic. It's a free to play PS4 title will be out later in the year. Free to play game. So what kind of, is there just one map? What kind of maps uh, do you have? Uh, currently there's one map. Um, the team has plans down the road for other stuff, but uh, currently there's one map. The big focus now is on characters. So we have, uh, I think, 12 characters in game, and we have more characters in the pipe once the game's live to release as well. So the big focus is going to be on characters and variety of characters at the moment. How long would a typical map match last? It depends. Uh, the goal from the team is about 15 to 20 minutes. The timer's at 20, so 20 is the max. Um, we used to be like 40 to 50 minutes, but it's something they wanted to kind of get in control a little bit. So currently it's a 20 minute match. Uh, goal, like I said, about 15 to 20. Very cool. James, I know you had a little bit of time to spend with it. What did you think? Oh, I loved it. I had a lot of fun. I uh, killed a developer and turned him to the dark side, essentially, and that was awesome. Uh, might be the highlight of my day. Uh, one thing, uh, it's a free game, so is there going to be like an in-game currency? Yeah, uh, there's either gold you can buy or there's uh, credits you earn. So. Um, certain things will be only available for gold, so we have like skins coming out later, that's only through gold. Um, there will be some ways to earn stuff in game though, um, but it's still, some things aren't quite flushed out yet, so we still have a little time for release, but. So it's going to be like a free rotation of characters, and then you unlock them through the in-game currency, or you guys haven't worked all that out yet? Uh, it's not officially like fully fleshed out. Uh, currently you have to buy all the characters, so you start with the trial character, so you play a match with uh, either Vincent, Sylvan, or Diesel. Yep. Through there you pick one of those characters and you start earning towards your other ones. Um, there's more progression. There's also like masteries and augments. There's some depth to the characters. You start customizing them. But yeah, currently there's no, I guess, no free characters at the moment. It's the one you initially start with. It's it's probably the first like MOBA style game I've seen with a twin stick shooter. Was that like, was that like one of the original founding ideas behind it? Uh, I haven't been on since the beginning of the game. I've been on yeah. for about a year. But I mean, it's been twin stick the whole time. It's switched quite a bit. They used to have like two way turning and other things. So it's kind of taking its time to get to where it is now. Um, yeah, the twin sticks are really easy to pick up control, as you guys probably experienced. It's fairly easy twin sticks, and then the shoulder buttons do your ability. So they want to keep it somewhat simple, so it's accessible to a lot of people. Yeah. Well, it was a lot of fun. It looked awesome, and it's free to play. Really, there's no there's no downside anywhere here. So, yeah. so you said this year, 2016? It is out sometime this year. No release date yet. Though. Okay. Awesome. Cool. Sounds good. Zach, thanks so much, man. Thank Appreciate it. Pleasure oh, meeting yeah. you. We've got one question for you. Yes. Who would win in a fight between Batman and Spider-Man? Uh, probably deadlift from Kill Strain, actually. He would win. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, there you have Adding it. Adding that to the poll. <laughs> All right, keep it here on Press Start TV.